Okay, so today I'm going to teach you, going to be teaching you guys how to use the Turbulent Displace tool in After Effects. For my animation, I use the effect to create steam as it is rising up from my mug of tea. Um, basically, the Turbulent Displace tool is used to smoothly scramble or warp one of your objects. Um, a lot of people use it to make fire, clouds, waves, and other things like that. So to start, I already um, mess with my position, scale, and opacity. So I use position. Um, you can see like the position is more swiggly as it moves up, like steam does. And then I use the scale. So as it um, raised higher, the T got smaller. And then the opacity, I also lowered that. So at the beginning, it's at 100%. But then as you go further into the animation, it um, lowers to zero and starts to disappear. So for the turbulent displace effect you can go up to your effects and panels and type in turbulent displace and then you can just drag it into your animation and then there's this little effects panel and then you can go in here like this. So the only um, two that I used to create the steam effect were the um, amount tool over here and then the offset turbulence one. The amount is used um, to create better distortion so the higher the amount here the more distortion you'll, your object will have and then the offset um, determines the shape that is used to create the distortion. So to start um, you can press the little stopwatch for amount and I started it at zero so it looks like a normal T and then every second or so, um, I kind of just toggle around with the amount to make it um, distort more and then it, I have it distorting more um, as the animation goes on. So yeah, I'll just do that. Just keep distorting it and then you can kind of see how it's already distorting enough. And then I also added the offset turbulence and I did the same thing where um, at one second I will mess with the left one to give it even a more distortion among the shape that I have. I'm just going. Okay, so that's all I did for the steam, and as you can see, it's kind of um, moving along as it goes up. Um, you can, depending on what your preference is, you can add more or bring them closer together. But yeah, that's how you do that.